you have an opportunity to look at the transfer question I had for you about the transfer, transfer station? I can't hear you, Michael. The transfer station? I, Jennifer had all the questions down. Was that one that you remember? The difference between using one person and two people? And the, well, no, there used to be a part-time part person working part -time. at the transfer station. And right. you, you haven't replaced him, and you've got three uh, people working overtime now. The, you, the union... The Teamsters Union contract specifies that the the manager of the uh, transfer station it's a Teamster position. Uh, well, I hand you the the copy of the union's contract, and that's not what it says right on the first page. Is it specifically eliminates that from being a consideration from the union contract? Right on the front page of the union contract. I gave you the copy of that whole mess last last time you were here. I I've, I've read that. Uh, equally as well as you have, and I guess I would have to disagree respectfully. The, I don't understand how you can come to that conclusion, but that it's a negotiated contract. I have no authority to override that contract. And it says very specifically in the contract that it's not a union position. And, we, and didn't we ask which I was contract on the board you were printing we, from? We I was on the board Mark Richardson's position as manager of the transfer station is a Teamster position. And on the weekends, it is a Teamster position. And the Teamsters have elected to fill that position. They had reached previously agreement with the former director that could they use a part-time person three out of four right, weekends. In the and they acquiescence to that. When he left, they no longer acquiescence to that provision. But it was in the contract from 14 to 16, so the contract would still be in place when you've changed it, is my problem. I mean, then, it's going to end up costing the town a few, a few, few thousand dollars when you can have a person doing that for uh, part time, and you're going to be paying people. Not without a union grievance. And we were already doing that way. You did. We are not doing that currently. We have not been doing it for almost 18 months that way. Well, why are you just now putting in overtime and reducing the part time wages then? If you just already been doing it for 18 months. Because. By the time we actually get down to negotiating the contract and or preparing this budget, that's when it, we got caught up to it. So you, you haven't, been, have you, if this is in your new contract that the voters haven't approved yet, you mean? No. Because the one that had what I said was still in effect in 2016. And I just said I respectfully disagree with you. I believe your interpretation of the contract to be wrong. If you think I'm wrong, please take it up with the town manager. End of discussion.